she's so cool looking. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And she'll start to look like she's a scorpion. That's cool, right? What? Some people are creeped out by things that crawl, but for Entomology here, Association President Madeline Bloomquist no, okay. and VP okay. Kylie Gallegos, they were always interested in learning more about the world of insects. I think the coolest thing that I've learned is just being able to like walk around and be like, oh hey, that's so and so. Just having an idea of what's around now. Mm -hmm. I really like that, especially like the odd things. Like you can walk past a bush and there's like this little thing of, that looks like spit somewhere. Mm -hmm. and it's a spittle bug, you just know that. One thing they hope to accomplish before graduating this year is to encourage high school students to seek out a different path for their future careers. People don't think like entomology is a thing that you would like go to school to study for. And so like they get here and they already have like their major decided. And like it'd be cool if they like had more ideas of what they could do. One way the Entomology Club piques the interest of younger generations is by putting together a monster movie night once a year around Halloween time and they bring out the stars of the show, a large variety of insects. A lot of them are creeped out. A lot of the parents, I think, mostly are creeped out and a lot of the kids are like, oh, this is so cool, which is like really fun to see. It's like really fun to see like the little kids like, oh, I want to hold it, I want to do this. And they're like, look, mom, like hold it. And they're like, no. So it's like, that's really cool to see like the little kids super into it. If you weren't able to make it this year, there's always next Halloween. So mark your calendars for the next monster movie night. For News 22, I'm Victoria Valderrama. Oh, okay. Males live like two or three years. Do you like it? They live a